we're going to make our very own wind vane so you can collect weather data in your own backyard. To start, we'll need one plastic straw, two paper plates, a pencil with a new eraser, scissors, tape, a poster board, a straight pin, a ruler, modeling clay, and a table fan. First, write the directions of north, south, east, and west along the edges of an upturned paper plate. Make sure the letters are spaced equally apart on the paper plate with the directions in the right order. Use the scissors to cut an arrow tail and point from the poster board. Make sure that the arrow tail is much bigger than the point. Next, take the straw and make inch-long slits in each end with the scissors. Then slide the arrow point and tail into the slits, creating an arrow. Next, stick the straight pin through the exact center of the arrow and into the pencil eraser. Make sure you leave enough space on either side of the straw for it to spin. Now, stick the pointed end of the pencil through the center of the paper plate and into the modeling clay, which will act as a base. Finally, tape this plate to the second paper plate, facing right side up with the clay base inside. If you're doing this outside, you can use a compass to align north on the plate to north on your compass. Now it's time to test your wind vane using your table fan to act as the wind. As the wind blows, the vane will spin, pointing in the direction that the wind is blowing. Changes in wind direction often accompany changes in the weather. You can also use stronger materials like wood, metal, or plastic to make a more permanent version. Use it outside and you can be your own meteorologist. Try it yourself.